Hello, this is Avery with Online Income Network. In today's video, I'm gonna show you how you can edit and delete your songs on SoundCloud. You already see them on SoundCloud and I'm already signed in as well. So I'm going to go ahead and click on my name, go to profile, and you can see right under all, you can go to all the tracks, but you can see I got my tracks up here and I'm just gonna go ahead and go to edit. If I want to go ahead and delete a song, I can go to more. You can see right at the bottom is delete. Let's go ahead to edit. You can see I got three tabs. I got basic info, metadata, and permissions. Right above basic info, you have download original file. And right beside that, you have replace file. If you just want to replace the file without deleting it, you'll have to have the pro subscription on SoundCloud to be able to do that. But as far as the basic info is concerned, you can see I got title the genre additional tags description i got the privacy whether i make it public or private and then i can change my image right here going over to the next tab you got metadata I ask you if it contains music you got yes or no then you can put other information like the artist publisher the isrc code composer release title you got your buy link so it redirects your customers to where they can buy the actual song if you want to learn how to do that, check out this video here that should be popping up. And of course, you have the rest of the other info in up here, like contains explicit content. You can put yes or no. You have your licenses, which is all rights reserved or Creative Commons. So you can choose to have all rights reserved or you can choose to give some permissions to people that may want to use your work. And then last, you have permissions where you got you can enable direct downloads, offline listening, include RSS, include RSS feed, display embed code, enable app playback, and then, and then the last thing you can do, if you have a pro account, you can do things like have your comments public or private, and then you can show stats. And really, that's all you need to know. Whenever you finish making your changes, you can go ahead and press save changes here. And all your changes are done. So hopefully the video was useful to you. If it was, why don't you go ahead, like, subscribe, share with a friend. Click the bell notification to get notified when new videos come out from me because I make new videos every week. Thanks for watching.